The time has come. It is time to move. Yeah, this is what I've been doing for like the past month is just angsting about moving, delaying, putting stuff in boxes. And now that I need to be out by the end of the month, I'm like, game on. So, you know, I got a trash bag for the things that I no longer want. I'm just cleaning everything off. And honestly, like some of this stuff is making me very, very nostalgic because my room, in case you haven't noticed, is like the, it's an absolute mixture of my life. Like seriously. Leaf stuffed animals are from when I was like a little kid. These, like the, the furniture, when I was eight. The bed, the sea stuff was from like when I was 16. And now just like all the gadgets and stuff, the camera, the mandala, are all the adult me. And I've hated it for so many years. It's like, I'm so tired of coming into a room where it's just like, oh yes, this reminds me of when I was eight. Or I come over to this side, I'm like, oh yeah, I was 16 and I just wanted stuff, but I didn't really know what stuff it was that I wanted. It's just, it's so disorganized and I am just, I'm tired of the chaos. I need a change. I need a stable place. Yeah, that's, that's been my life so far. I'm gonna miss this place because I have lived here for 23 years. I'm gonna start throwing stuff away while I'm doing this because I... Focus, please. Excuse me. Yes, find me. There you are. I've just been putting this off for way too long, so... Yeah. Join me in this new moving adventure that I have never done before. This is my first time moving. I hate it. I made this my junior year. No, my senior year of high school. I was actually quite proud of this. It's supposed to be your picture frame. Sorry, but I just don't use it. I have matured and I am now one of those people who's like, oh, I'm no longer using this. To the dump with you. Unless someone else can use it and then I donate it, of course. I don't know why, but when I was a kid, I loved to dress my stuffed animals in jewelry, like it was clothes. And now I find it very, very hard to get rid of them. Like, I can't, I can't do it. Oh my God, Shiva. If anyone is looking for a good read, The Red Pyramid is a great series. Big brain energy. Don't waste more boxes. Use the space that you already have. By that I mean finding empty stuff like this and then filling it. Apparently I used to use paper napkins as bookmarkers. Smart. Okay, so when I was a kid, I've always wanted to go to the beach, right? Like it was just uh, every kid's dream, I guess, to go to the ocean. I didn't get to do that until I was 14. And I kept the ticket from that day. I also kept the receipt of the Nefertari exhibit that I went to go see in March. It's like, these are the memories that I made in this room. And I think that's why it's kind of hitting me in a way I was not expecting. I didn't think I would be looking at these little things that I kept and be like, oh damn, I remember that. It makes you feel a certain type of way. If I ever go to Egypt, I got 10 bucks to spend. You don't understand how desperate I've been since this year started. 
I started keeping all the good fortunes I've gotten from fortune cookies. So let's practice manifestation and speak this into existence for ourselves and everyone else that we care about. Just the world in general. I think everybody needs some help. A good position and a comfortable salary will be yours. Winning starts with beginning. Motivation for today. It is very possible that you will achieve greatness in your lifetime. It's not guaranteed, but it's a possibility. And in life, you gotta live for the little things. It's like, oh, there's only a 10% chance of me getting what I want? Awesome! Yesterday I checked, it was zero. That is an improvement. Bye, big thumbtacks, you served me well. Ooh, this guy's fat with money. Oh my god, this is when I started my YouTube channel. <laughs> I started in 2018. Bro, Nat! Oh my, I miss you, dude. I miss you. I miss all the adventures that we've had, bro. Can't freaking believe it. Wow. Life really does come at you fast when you least expect it. Like, you may think, like, oh, hey, I'm in the, like, this stagnant point of my life. Like, bro, ish is still happening. You're just not paying attention. Okay, that's all the time I had for today. I have to go in for my shift now, so I'm gonna get dressed and I will see y'all later. This room is uh, it's gonna be a distant memory pretty soon. Is it normal that I feel like sad, but then also numb to that sadness at the same time? I don't know. Anyway, I'll see you tonight. I'm gonna pack some more tonight, so I'll see you then. Bye. Hey everyone. It's, it's been a few days since I last recorded my moving video. So I'm just kind of cleaning everything up, you know. These tables, I did not realize that they were like having watermarks on them and stuff. But yeah, I'm just doing what moving people do. So I've just set up a little donation thing right here. My trash is going in here, but the donations are right there. I'm trying to figure out if I can donate these pictures. I love them, but I'm not going to have any room for them. And then these starfish, which I think I'm just going to, you know, throw away because I don't think anyone would want them. They're not real starfish. So here we go. Continuing on my moving journey. I'm so thrilled. Guys, it's hitting me. The nostalgia is hitting me. Gosh. It's just, when you literally grow up someplace, it's like you kind of have difficulty imagining being anywhere else. So that's kind of where I am. And it's like, I'm looking at all this stuff, literally what I've accumulated over my lifetime. And it's, I don't know how I said, like it's frustrating because I have so much stuff and a lot of it's from when I was a kid. Well, sometimes I look at this stuff from when I was a kid, I'm like, Shit, I remember this. Like this poster. It has two dolphins on it. And it says, true blue friends. Summer gave this to me. It, it used to be hanging on my door. Man, she gave this to me when we were like 12. I'm 23. I didn't really think time would pass me by this quickly. It's ca kind of causing an existential crisis. I'm keeping this. Are you kidding me? That's triggering a core memory. I can't let that go. Hey, you see this? I was an artist when I was a kid. What's your kid doing? When I say I was an artist, these were one of the things where it's like, oh, hey, paint inside the lines. But I still think I did a pretty good job. Fortunately though, I don't really have any uses for it, so. Goodbye, my friends. It was a joy creating you, looking at you hang on my door for many, many years even into adulthood. I hate being unnecessarily sentimental about items because this is the scrap from my vision board. The scrap. I kept it. Why? I wasn't gonna do anything with it. I just looked at it and I was like, huh, I remember when I did that. My vision board's right there. I didn't need this. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh my freaking god, are you joking? 
Bro, this is my 2006 Acer laptop. It hasn't worked for three years. Again, I still have it. I'm a ferret. I freaking collect things and I just hide them everywhere. Oh my God, I'm a klepto. Big girl, biggie. Okay, I have to go to work pretty soon and my camera's about to die, so this is the progress that I have made so far. This corner is gonna be the last because it's kind of like while I'm living here and still close to work, I work like pretty dang close and where I'm gonna be moving, it's gonna be like damn near an hour away. But I have made all this progress so that I could bring in more boxes because I have that much stuff. Um, I haven't even begun to open the drawers and stuff. So I, oh my God, I haven't even touched my closet. I hate moving. I hate packing. I hate packing so much. I hated it when I was helping my friends move and I hate it now that I'm moving. This sucks. So I'm just going to say my plan. I am hoping to have all of my donated stuff out by this weekend and then everything else I'm just going to start throwing in boxes and labeling the boxes like stuff for work or pajamas like being that literal so I can live out of boxes for a few weeks until I can get some more furniture because I'm not taking this eight-year-old stuff with me. I'm sorry, it served its purpose. It's just no longer for me. So I will get back to you probably while I'm in the middle of doing it because I cannot multitask, especially with something like this. So I will see you in probably a few days. Bye. Mm -hmm.